<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to South Code Live. Okay, I don't know about you, but I am so it, 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 it's in for spring. <laughs> I'm trying to scratch it's it. It's supposed to snow it's, in New York that's City. That's not on Friday. spring. That's not the definition what? of spring. Not in my book. We are jump starting to know. I know Dimpy's like, what? Yeah, well, I yeah. know. Yeah. Well, it's gonna snow. But anyway, to get everyone <laughs> in the mood for spring, we've got bold and beautiful color inspiration from celebrity makeup artist Frank Guyton. Welcome, yeah. Johnny. Hey, hello. Look at you. Look at you. Beautiful. Don't leave me oh out my of here. gosh! Frankie, you got much love moment. to go around. I'm not <laughs> leaving you. Okay, bye. It's Please so don't. nice Both to have you. you here, Frank. Thank you for having me. All and right. Speaking of spring, like, I know. we have so much to talk about with we makeup. Gotta these pop we got to talk about these pops of color. So, our first hot hue. Is you are all blue. about <gasps> blue. This is the color trend that is going to by far be all over the, um, everywhere so for good. spring and summer. So get ready for it. And what we have is this yeah. amazing liner mm -hmm. from L'Oreal in this amazing blue. And Ms. Erin here is helping look, us out. Yes, she is. And this don't is forget, we've got customer reviews scrolling at the bottom of your screen. Check them out, but check out Frank, Frank's uh, application process. Yeah, so tell so us about what we it. did is we left one eye um, undone so you can see, like for those women out there who like to go there, because you know, this is a really cool look. It's mm -hmm. bold. It's, you know, it's a little avant-garde, and so you can really do a lot with blues. Like, if you are this kind of woman, great. What we did is what we put on the liner first, and right. this is a really great felt pen that felt. we have. Right. So the work is there for you already. So all you have to do, a little trick, because everyone is like, how do I put on well, a liner? How do you put on a So cat? let me tell you, I want to keep it very simple and easy for you guys. Okay. okay. Especially for you ladies Spell at home. So all you need to do is... First, draw your line on the outside, right? Uh -huh. And then what you want to do is you want to make like a V, and then all you do is bring it all the way back over to the inner corner, and then you just fill it in. It's really easy. So good it's to how see it your should technique. be. It should be very easy yeah. that way. Although, you know what? Having symmetry there with the eyes can be a little challenging. Practice makes perfect. It's totally. the only way, right, Frank? Yes. So you good. Practice. Just have a little bit of makeup remover on a Q-tip right there exactly. next to your exactly. little eyeliner just in case. Keep, keep the timing of your plans flexible afterwards. Exactly. You never know. But actually, no, the precision of this L'Oreal Paris Compatible Paint Eyeliner is amazing. It because really is. It's all the work, guesswork there is for you. So yeah. you get precision, like you said. It's almost like a pin. Price is right too, under eight bucks. Amazing, and the color is Vivid Aqua. Mm. Okay, so obviously you used a little wash of some eyeshadow yes. on here now, as well. Now this is something you've seen all over the runway and in the magazines, and mm. this is very easy, and still um, still it makes a great aqua blue mm. like this. And all you have to do, there's two ways that you can do this. Okay. Let's talk about the easy way first. Mm -hmm. okay. Take a really big brush like this. This is a color dome brush, mm -hmm. eyeshadow brush. What happens is when you use this brush and you put it inside of the um, pigments, it actually disperses the color over really lightly, like a watercolor. Right. Top off the excess, and that what we're gonna do here is we're just going to wash over like a windshield wiper. Oh. And you can see how easy that is. You don't have to be very precise about it. Just right. get it on there. And it gives like you just so. a little taste of the flavor and the yes. trends without, you know, looking but if like. If you want a little more pigment, take another brush like this one. This is more dense, right? right? So it's gonna pack on the pigments. Right, really lay it on there. And really lay it on it. And a little trick I like to do is I like to go over the liner. Oh, because good. what happens is it makes the liner look wet. Mm -hmm. So you've taken oh. the look and you've completely changed it right. into something different, yeah, right? Look yes. how gorgeous that is. You got so, all sorts of goodies in there as well. You got vitamin E. It's yes. going to provide like an antioxidant protection on your eyelids, which is great because that area is so sensitive. It is mm. sensitive. You know? But what's really great, if you don't want to do a full wash like this, maybe you just go in the inner corner of the eye okay. and just give your pop of color there right. and just do the liner. That way you can pare it down a little bit because this might be a little too much. Yeah. But there's so many different ways you can do it. Whatever your personality is, yeah. find it and then play and then you've, you've go got it. it. Yeah, you got it. Highlighter. Totally, you can do yeah. either or. You can do the eyeliner, the shadow, do it underneath. Yes. So many trends. So many and it's ways. interesting too because last year we saw the bold blue lip. This yes. year it's transitioned to the eye. This is where it's at, y'all. Check right. out pop art. And a little, Love little, it. little extra is um, little icing on the cake or cherry on the top. Put on the lash. That really oh. kind of just takes the look. And Gives you some va va, va boom. boom. <laughs> all right, now check out, all this, va -va -boom, I know, check out all those products talk? below in the style carousel. But next. Blue isn't just for your eyes. No, Where no, else no. are we seeing this trend? Okay. Yes. <laughs> right here on the nails. So we got the Essie Gel Couture Nail Polish. So good in first view. 
Why Look at is this, this color. a winning nail polish? Because this is the color of the season, and it's also really nice. It's really light, it's beautiful, it's fresh. Mm -hmm. And what's really great about this is this particular nail polish will last you how many, like two weeks. Yeah, and I gotta say, I love hearing this from an expert like yourself, but I, this is like tried and true. I love this nail polish. I've been testing it out ever since mm -hmm. it came out, mm -hah. and I probably have like, Twenty bottles that I've collected, and we use here. Are you going to share? Of course, of course, of course. You have to with Aaron. We got, but um, this blue is, is incredible. It's pretty epic. But and it really it gives you like that hard nail, just like a gel color that you would maybe at your salon. Yeah. I mean, a fraction of the price, and you get to go home with the bottle of the nail polish as well, um, but it'll last about two weeks or yes. so, and I mean, it's just, you don't have to use that UV lamp. And you ladies don't have to always go to the nail salon. It's mm -hmm. like gonna be chip proof, basically. Yeah, I will still go to the salon for you. <laughs> <laughs> but you also have that hugging uh, brush as well, patent yes. pending on it, but it just helps you uh, really get the, the polish that on brush there. Is amazing. Smoother, yeah, I mean, you don't even have to have a base coat with this, two layers, no. done deal, let it dry for a second, and then, you go in with the top coat. So the Look top this, coat baby. comes with each color that you purchase. Yes. So eleven fifty for both, um, and this is just like allows you to, to lock and load that color in. Yes, lock and load, and then you're ready to go. <laughs> yes. And I can think, I tell you a funny story? Tell me, so please. I'm like obsessed okay. with this nail polish, Frank. You do not know. I have I serious. Think you're, you've got twenty of them. I mean, yes, come on. Like, I love the nail game. Yeah. Um, so I literally repainted my nails last summer, July fourth. I went out and played a softball game, but like right before mm -hmm. I painted my nails, some bright, brilliant red color, which we have coming up. And I went out and played softball with hey. this gel-like Essie Couture. Hey. You know what's really great Fun about these there. colors? Yeah, the, and didn't mess up your nails, that's no, the whole point. Didn't. That's it, yeah. didn't mess up your nails. What's great about this hue too is that women of all skin tones can wear this. So yeah. don't be afraid of it, whether you're fair, medium, or deep, you can wear it. I mean, totally. just play with it, because there's many different ways. And I think if you put this up to your face, and like, give like me that, that's a selfie right moment. There. <laughs> yeah, and something just still, another little fun fact for you guys. And oh, helpful do you guys remember tip. this? <gasps> the Tweaksy! Show them, show them back. that. How does that work? All right. Give it to them. We've it's been the playing with Oh, look at that. Can you do this for me? Oh, whoa, there's right. a nail. I could let you do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, girl. Uh, the Tweaksy is genius, especially for folks that want to paint their nails at home. It just kind of gives you a little more stability with the bottle of the nail polish. Because sometimes you're like, okay, where do I set my fingernails? Like it's my less hands, room to the travel nail polish from the bottle yes. to the nail. Right, it's literally right there. Right, so you're not slopping. Idea. Right, you're not slopping uh, a large amount of polish onto your nail, which ma makes it not dry as quickly. Right. Um, so this makes it really efficient, keeps it stable. Look. Girl, you yeah. could be on a plane, a train, a car. <laughs> you could be walking around and painting your nails. So good. My mom so. has one in every color, I think, to match the nail polish. So like good. a Tweetsie to match oh, the nail polish. Check it all out below in your style carousel, guys. That's great. All so right. that's your blue. So that's good. your spring well, blue. Well, shall we move on then? Yes, we should. Let's, let's Thank you, darling. It. All right, so Frank, you and Rachel share a color crush. Yes. What is it? This is the orange. This is our big color of the season. This is that pop of color. And this right here from Maybelline is the amazing amazing lip paint, basically. When I tell you there's so much rich pigment in this, and what you see is what you get. And I just wanna show you a little trick. A lot of women see this color and they're like, oh my God, it's so much color. Yeah. I don't know if I can do that. But there are women who love to put that color in there. So a little trick is, a way to do this is to take a little bit, right? Yeah. And just oh, go, look at, how look a, look at that, that pigment. Is. Look at it. Oh, and it's Orange Outburst. What a yes, great name. I love that name. It's almost I just as love good as Radioactive Tomato. <laughs> it's close. What you can do, too, there's many different ways to put on your lipsticks. Maybe if this is too bold for you, but you want to stay wow. current in your makeup wardrobe, just bleed it out. Make it look like a stain. And therefore, if you do that, you still on trend. Rub that together for me. Right? Look wow. at that. And you've beautiful. got that beautiful sunset color. Wow. Or you can go in and really go in and, and put it on. What I love about this particular applicator is it's a doe foot. And all you need to do is really go in there. Give me your face. Give me that beautiful face. Give me your face. Yes. Give me those lips. Look at that, that color. Face. Now that, let's really saturate it on there. Wow. Look at that color. And what's really great about this, women at home need to know, sometimes you have a woman who wants to go with the eye and the lip. Yeah. But normally what I say is for balance, if you're going to do a bold lip, do a soft eye like we have here. But mm. if you're going to do a bold eye, do a soft lip. So this is a little bit of a trick because we want to create balance. 
I love that it's going on like a stain, but as you, but as you said, but it's not a stain. No. You can just wipe that right off. You can wipe that right off. And what's, amazing. Isn't that creamy and nice? Mm -hmm. And this is a gloss, so I'm gonna tell you a minute now, we're going into glosses. Right. We're going out of the matte and into the gloss, so get ready because. Thank goodness. Yes, I know, right? I like it's a shiny a lip. I do too. I love a shiny and, lip. You know what, light reflects light, so it gives a, a, the illusion of a fuller, larger lip, and we all want and that, right? And a healthier right? lip. I'm, I'm a healthier. little split on the glossy lip. Are you? I mean, I'm hopping Why? on that bandwagon, but can I tell you, what? when you're a gal, it's spring, the wind is blowing, your hair gets it's high stuck, in your lip oh, gloss, know, it comes across and it gives you whiskers. I know, With a matte lip, it stays put. Yeah. Nobody but likes whiskers. You just reapply. So ladies, keep your hair ties handy. That's all I gotta say. I remember when I was a woman, <laughs> literally in a show, just <laughs> hair all over my face yeah. because of my lipstick. Yes. So you have an instant nail update. What is it? This one, listen, if you have orange lips, you gotta have orange fingernails, right? It's just hand in hand. Look at this, also from yes. Essie. This is a beautiful color, just like the blue that we had on before. And when I tell you the pigment is so rich, just look at that. It's called Flash, so I think you should flash. Yes. Yes, no yes. Malone. Yes. yes. Get rid, ditch the red and go with something like this, right? It's, yeah. it's time for a change, it's spring. So vibrant. Yeah, it is vibrant, and it just really kind of reflects your own personality. It makes you feel different, too, when you put on color. Yeah, and as with the other nail polishes, it will yeah. last for 14 days, you guys, which is 14. gonna, that's Can you so imagine? wonderful. Like, the come, time to be able to have saving. two weeks, right. exactly like my gel, which I sit in the chair and do. Like, right. I can't do gels at home, but, but now I can. <gasps> Amazing. And then and you have the top, top coat. coat. Yeah, comes always, with the top coat, which is fantastic. Always um, a necessity. Thank you, thank you so much, <laughs> Michelle. Well, come on over here to our yes. third gal, oh Miss Morgan. One of my favorite, I mean, favorite, favorite Right? Is, Finally, it is yes. time to talk. Pink. pink. Every girl loves pink, right? Of There's course. so many shades of pinks, right? Yes, I do. But, <laughs> but what we really love about this particular um, blush, and I'm going to tell you a little trick. Uh -huh. Blush doesn't just have to be on the cheek. Okay. You can actually put it on the eye, too. Mm -hmm. What we've done here for you is to show you that you, of course, the apples of the cheek are the proper place to put the mm -hmm. blush. But also what you can do is you can just brush a little bit on the brow bone to give a little bit uh. of a fresh, open wake look so and pretty. it's very modern and very new it was a little brush a little, a little so let me right show there. you what's really don't great don't want anyone thinking you got a little hair right there <laughs> <laughs> no, there you go i gotta help a girl out okay so this one's by bourgeois bourgeois is a great baked blush and why it's so great is because it's really pigmented and i love the component you've got your brush already there that's so cute you've got your mirror, mirror. how cute is that right is look great. at that oh. it's so velvety, right? It is super soft to the touch, very nice. So what's really great about this is, I have two brushes for you. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna show you this brush, which is, you know, great for eyeshadow, but, right. and this one for the actual blush. So the way that you wanna do this is you wanna put it in, okay. tap off the excess, smile a little bit. Women always want to know, where do I put my blush? I see them on the train and they're haphazardly just putting well, it on first, their face. you can't be putting it on in the train. No, you shouldn't, right? <laughs> but you okay. ladies do. We do sometimes. You find any place you can Think. to put on your makeup. And I really, I give you props for it because the trains are moving, cars are moving. You, it's not easy. It's not easy. But so but, with Morgan here, where's the proper placement? So the proper placement I always like to tell my ladies is to smile. Okay. And right there on the apples, that's the apple of the cheek. You want to go in a circular motion, buff it in, mm -hmm. and just lightly, blend it all the way in the back. And this is the trick I wanted to tell you. Right. Take the brush, the blush brush, and just go right on that brow bone that and just go right in there. Kind of gives her that monochromatic, fresh, yes. youthful look. Yes, and that's what we're going for. This this is what it is. Pinks are really soft and easy and mm -hmm. really fresh and beautiful. Right. And if you want to be more pigmented, uh -oh. you can use... Take a, it up another notch? You can notch? take it up another notch all by right. using a denser um, eyeshadow brush okay. and actually just putting it in the blush on the eyelid right. and or in the crease or on the brow bone like we have for going so for gorgeous. transitioning from the daytime to the night. Yeah, yeah, you can just wet it and make it really, yes. really, yeah. really pronounced. Yes. Oh, which would be very you. Right. you know your little Girl, tricks, don't you? I know you? my makeup, come on. <laughs> and it has a nice uh, aroma as well. It smells yes. like rose, which is really nice. Uh, is it rose? Yeah, a little nice addition to that. Right. So I love that. Not only can you look like a rose, but you can, you can smell like Morgan, a rose. Morgan, and you look like a rose, darling. Yeah, really so check do. it out below in our style carousel. And finally, I mean, you've got to have a nail shade color that matches your blush, right? The It Factor, quite literally. So Morgan's rocking it on her nails again by uh, Essie, the Gel Couture Nail Polish.
color is in it factor and mm. it is for sure an it factor it this is. season, right? <laughs> it is giving us epic moments right here. And I had to get into it Did as you? well. Look at this. Yeah. Look, at the, look at the array of color so of good. pinks though. It's so beautiful. Mine's model citizen. Oh, we are model pink are? citizens here. Mine's Joan <laughs> so good. Salon. Well, Morgan, thank you. Ladies, thank, thank you, you so much. And Frank, you thank rock. You. So, thank so, you. so, so oh, good. Yeah. Yeah, to you, you Frank. too, you Frank. Thank you, Always.